you know, I would like to uh, make some comments since I've spent my entire career in the stroke field and, uh, you know, being devoted to stroke prevention and stroke treatment. It's basically all I've done. So an individual can only do so much. And uh, we all have to rely on big organizations to reach the hundreds, thousands, and of course, ultimately millions across the world of people who suffer from stroke and who need information and who need education and who need resources and support. So that is why I would like to say, just to put it in context, here's a great organization for stroke, American Heart Association. The stroke division is called the American Stroke Association. So I want to set that as an example. What's in my mind an equally valuable organization, just as valuable as the American Heart Association, the Rene Marie Language of Love Foundation. Um, this foundation does such fantastic work. And Ginny, who communicates with me on a regular basis and who has had some experience and knows very well what it is to have a stroke, this kind of organization to me is invaluable and every bit as important and makes every bit as much a contribution to our knowledge and dissemination and education of stroke as an organization which has been around for God knows how many decades, like the American Heart Association. I consider the Rene Marie Language of Love Foundation equivalent and maybe on a personal level even better because the American Heart Association doesn't invite me very often to come and speak, and uh, you do. Um, so who could ask for more? I'm an individual clinician treating one patient at a time, and your kind of organization reaches huge numbers, and it's education and knowledge, and that education and knowledge will allow more and more people to be treated and to be cured of their strokes. So thank you.